just getting started on the wedding day. Dropped Jill off this morning at her hair appointment. I think she was a little nervous kind of going into that, not knowing the salon at all that's gonna do her hair on her wedding day. But she's feeling good, she's so easy going. She just said she's ready for it, she's excited. She doesn't really care exactly what the updo is. I think that's the right word. Uh, so I'm gonna go try to get us some smoothies, a little windy. And I'll check back in in a second. Just getting back to the hotel room now and just picked up a PB&J smoothie, a little summer berry smoothie. What else did I get? Oh yeah, got two things of avo toast because we're vegan millennials and what else would we really eat? So just gonna set this up, wait for Jill to be done her hair. I'll go grab her and then we'll have some breakfast. Trying to keep up with this uh, vlog throughout the day so I don't wanna forget any moments, but um, just wanna show you guys on my phone how I'm currently filming this. <laughs> so doing whatever I gotta do to make this work. I also forgot that the majority of the time I have a mask around my neck because it's 2020 and we're in public. So if you guys are seeing a little mask sling below the neck, you know why. <laughs> but I'll check back in with you when I'm picking up Jill. I'm really excited to see your hair. Anything she does with her hair, I think looks great. So hello, excited to see that. Hello. Hi. I just got done. Okay, I'll come up and meet you. Yeah. I just got my hair done. I am so excited. I thought that I was gonna feel like nervous or anxious or something right now, but I'm just feeling so like full of gratitude and happiness and just like, I can't freaking wait to marry this man. Let me go see her. All right, let's see it. Ooh, I love it. Ah, it's happening. <laughs> so excited, <laughs> looks so good. I can't wait, this like makes it like more real. Yeah. Like, my hair's done. I know. <laughs> I did <laughs> not. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> All right, time to open cards, presents, cards, read cards. <laughs> What I love about you is everything. I will always love you. When you're down, I promise to always be there for you. Be patient and be kind. Mom. Mom. Yeah. What a way to start. Yeah. I'm glad we waited to read those until now, though. Yeah, that was cool. I'm ready to Now that we have recovered from <laughs> reading all of our cards and all the well wishes that everyone sent, we're heading over to pick up Jill's wedding bouquet, which we're super excited for. We had a little, what do you call it? The one that was in the room. It's like a mini version. Oh yeah, like my aunt gifted us flowers from the same flower shop. So if my bouquet is anything <laughs> yeah. similar to that, I know I'm gonna love it. So we're gonna walk up there, definitely getting our steps in on our wedding morning. Yeah. <laughs> Do it for the vlog. I've been holding in everything. I just want to say the words out loud. I wasn't really expecting to have one of these. We're Thank you, Joe. Pretty spoiled. Thank you. First bottle of champagne of the day. Ah! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! We've been going hard on the champagne, but we're still not getting through. Feeling 
better than I expected, but definitely starting to feel the nerves. Saying my vows, just kind of nervous to uh, get through those. Three weeks ago, they laid in the exact spot that we're getting married for three hours by myself and just wrote them start to finish, one shot. And wow. So that's pretty much that's tweaked awesome. a couple things after uh, losing a close friend last week. Just kind of built in some things to you know, memorialize him because he's yeah. super heavy on our hearts today. Yeah. So yeah. Exactly three weeks from today, I will be back at this spot, but I will be seeing the most beautiful bride come down this walkway right here. I just wrote all my vows. <laughs> I just want to say all the right things and I just want you to know, Jill, how much I truly love you. I don't know if I can ever put words to those feelings, but I hope I did it some justice. I'll see you in three weeks. I never knew what love was until I held you. I never knew the right words until I found you Every day before you I was holding down If you want the stars I can pull them down Baby in my arms you'll be safe and sound I'm sitting here in the car waiting for everyone to get set up and it's a good time to just sit Ooh. here and right? yeah. think about how amazing this marriage is going to be how amazing the guy is that I'm marrying and just like take this moment to breathe. Just take it in. Cody, <laughs> Jillian, I am thrilled and honored to witness, celebrate, and usher in the beginning of your life together. You got me thinking about marriage. I imagine the marriage between you, Cody, and you, Jillian, will look something like this. Continuing to fall in love all over again in the most beautiful destinations. <laughs> Dreaming over a shared pint of vegan ice cream. <laughs> Celebrating and capturing the big and small moments. Planting your lives where you decide to grow. May your marriage be a never-ending edit of beautiful vignettes. Captured and shared alongside and with each other. For as long as you both shall live. <laughs> Look into each other's eyes and see a reflection of yourself in the soul of your partner. It is that image of yourself and everything that you stand for that makes you so unique and desired by the person who is eager to be by your side for the rest of your life. Think about it. The combination of chances, choices, and changes that transpired before this very moment led to the formation of this perfect creation. The universe is smiling at you. So treat the blessings of the faith as the gifts from above and be the creators of your destiny. What you promise to each other today must be renewed and reaffirmed tomorrow and all the tomorrows to come. Cody, now you may read your vows. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Are you going to make it there? No. <laughs> There's no chance. You look amazing. Jillian. Just know I am so thankful to be standing right here with you today. Doing things the way that we want to do them, it doesn't get any better than this. From the first time I met you, I knew that there was something that drew me to you. There was a feeling as if I was home whenever I was with you, a feeling that I still have to this day. The same feeling that makes me want to be with you 24-7 and never get sick of it. I mean, I literally want to live in an 80 square foot van with you. How crazy is that? <laughs> For the rest of my life, 
I vow to love you with everything I have and to always be honest with you. I vow to try not to become a man of success, but rather a man of value. I vow to carry on my grandparents' 50 plus year old tradition of kissing each other three times and to always be your best friend. I vow to always sing and dance like no one is watching, Chan and Dakota style, <laughs> each and every day. Something tells me that this life we're about to start is going to be one hell of an adventure and I couldn't be more excited for that. So just know I love you. I love you with all my heart and I'll continue to love you each and every day. Well done, brother. Thank you. Well done. Well, Jillian. And now we turn our gaze to you. Cody, when I first saw you, I didn't know how much you were going to change my life for the better. I remember the exact moment I knew you were the one. The moment I knew that if anything were to ever happen to you, a part of my heart would be missing forever. The moment when I said, just now to you as if you could read my mind and understand exactly what I meant. Since that moment, without a sliver of doubt, you are and always will be the absolute love of my life. Thank you for loving me and thank you even more for understanding me. I vow to love you and understand you every day of our lives. I vow to never stop being completely obsessed with you. <laughs> I promise to trust you. I promise to continue loving you so deeply that you'll never have to question my intentions. I pinky promise to live every single day with you like we don't know what tomorrow will bring. I want to grow old with you by my side and live this life with no regrets. By the authority vested in me by the Universal Life Church <laughs> and the great state of Maine, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Cody, <laughs> you may kiss the bride. <laughs>